All right, Kaylee, have fun. Thank you. Diane, right now it looks like they just got the fleece on. I don't see any, you know, hats, gloves just yet. Just yet is that <laughs> phrase there. I'm glad that you've been watching the forecast because we do have a lake breeze that's going to set up tonight. So though we are forecasting temperatures by first pitch to be into the 50s with that cool nor northeasterly wind coming off the lake and right into fifth third field, I'm going to be wearing my coat. I would have my hat and I would have my gloves packed. I'd rather be uh, too warm than to be too cold because as we get throughout the day, here's that easterly wind that's going to be coming right off of Lake Erie. Now I know a lot of us on this forecast, the weather's perfect now, so we're going to take a check on that. But we also are going to be watching for this rainfall. So you can see here at 5 o'clock, no problem getting first pitch in or even a couple of innings in. And the rainfall, I anticipate that to not be much of a problem at all. If any rain does develop, it's going to be overnight. So getting that game in, we should have all nine innings. No problem. We will have, though, a little more cloud cover compared to what we have right now as we make that drive back into the office Wednesday. Now we do have some rainfall that will move in after lunch and it will actually be through the Toledo area by five o'clock. So if you're going to be taking that drive, though, further east or east of 75 tomorrow afternoon home from work, you are going to be working with a little bit of a wet weather, some heavier downpours as we get through our Wednesday. Now the mud hens forecast right now we have partly sunny conditions, but that lake breeze is going to allow for things to cool on out through the evening. And also I do anticipate a little more cloud cover to build in. So just be mindful to be a little bit of a cooler forecast than what we have for those who are tailgating now. now. Here's a look at what we anticipate those feels like temperatures to be as we head into this afternoon. We have 60s for many of us in Northwest Ohio, but in downtown Toledo, just barely making it to 60 degrees because of the lake breeze. And you can see that really wins out the later on we go into the evening. So that's why we're going to have those cooler conditions for the game. Right now, though, it's 47 here in Toledo. We do have 50 south and east there. You can see right along I-80 and east to 75. We're in the 50s. Otherwise, everybody else is sitting in those mid 40s. We had some fog this morning. That's why temperatures are a little stalled out in some locations, but we'll have partly sunny conditions throughout the day. Watching though for those clouds as temperatures head towards the lower 60s. We have a little bit of a cool down though and a big cool down come the weekend. We'll have 40s for Friday and Saturday. A chance of wet weather each day here for at least the rest of the work week. The weekend hopefully we can dry things out, but I know next week we're watching not only those warmer temperatures and hopefully though not too many rainy days. We want to get outside and enjoy 70 degrees on a couple of those days. Yes, that's it. It's not looking too bad. We're maybe turning a corner hopefully next week. Yes, and that of course though when the mud hens are back on the road, but for the opening <laughs> opening weekend, I don't think this is too bad of a forecast for it April. It could be worse. It could be a lot worse. We've dealt with yes, a lot worse. That's for have. sure. All right, Diane, thank you.